There you are. I got some good news. I got a little parcel today. Have a look at this. My new Roborock vacuum cleaner, the automatic one. Let's unpack that beauty and see and see what we got. First, I think we need we need a knife and then slowly unpack that gorgeous little thing. I hope I'm doing that right. Yep, looks that way. But they put a lot of effort in with the tape. Mmm, here we go. Let's put the knife away. Oh. No. Oh. Here we go. Oh, that is so good. Is there more tape to yeah. There is more tape. Okay. More knife. Marxie, there are emails. It is so nice that I'm able to tell myself that I got emails. Now that is a little bit of a surgery here to get that little flap undone. But it is done. Ah, oh, here we go. Wow, look at that. Okay, my friends, I will uh, unpack that. God, it's that's a mute. Oh my God. Oh no, that's in different languages. So okay, I think I had to to read all that. I wonder what that is. Some sort of panel, we will find out. And here, no, there's nothing there. And here's the machine itself. Okay. More tape, mate. More tape. Come on. I like these six here. Ah, oh, that is so gorgeous. table. Ah, I see that thing. Looks like that goes here. And there's the steering wheel. This is the, the drive. Okay. Let's get busy, guys. I will report in a moment. Ah, I know what this is. This is a charging station. Because that thing needs to be... That thing needs to be charged. Ah, here we go. Okay, in a moment. I will, yeah, we got the, the plug socket right there on the wall. And, God, this is so good. 
Okay, my friends. So far, so good. I will get that all put together and then we will see what we got. Okay, see you later. Have fun. Okay, after the first test run, our little Roborock has found his charging station because it was down to 17%. And it's now fully charged and I sent it on its way again. And it's uh, happily doing the rounds in the office. One thing I must say, I mean, this is so amazing. It is so easy to set up. It's just mind-blowing. I uh, used the... QR code to download the app, installed it, got into it, attached it to the to the unit and um, off it went. It's so easy to do. And now it is um, running around and I got caught twice. First it got caught underneath the exercise bike pedal. It went under it and then it couldn't get out. So I had to rescue it. And it tells you, I'm caught, I'm caught. It was so funny. Yeah, and the second time it went onto one of my shoes and couldn't get off it. So uh, that was easy. And the one thing I learned, we have to space our furniture apart so the Roborock can get between it. And the other thing I have to do now is um, finding out how to stop the machine from escaping out the front door. And um, I have to do a major cleanup um, in, the, um, in the shed so it won't um, get caught there underneath the car and uh, other items. Yeah, it just went between my feet and um, going into the front of the office. Ah, this is so nice. So let's see how much dust it has collected. I believe um, there will be quite a bit in it. And now I have to work out the routine how often I will send the robo cleaner on its way in the office and um, see how it uh, performs over the next week or so. And then I will probably have a good idea how often I'm going to use it and um, what to do. I think the best thing to do is to let it run while I'm not here because that way I don't have to watch it that it uh, escapes out of the front door. At the time I'm here I always have the front door open and uh, that might be not a good idea because there's a bit of a step to the outside and uh, I don't want any damage on that little unit. Yeah, so that sounds all very well. I'm very happy with the result and um, I can thoroughly recommend that unit. What I have seen so far, I didn't need to read the manual, that few centimeter thick thing. So all is good. I'm loving it. And uh, I had an idea about a new position for the charging station. I put that underneath the desk, so it's out of sight. I want the office look as empty as possible, so everything is uh, hidden very well. And um, yeah, that's about it. I will report at a later stage, and um, maybe I will attach a photo of the canister of the vacuum cleaner. Okay guys, we have a good time. See you later. Bye bye.